Gracias. What's wrong? Is it about what you said in your text? Yeah, I think saying it over the phone would be the same thing. Okay, so? Well... Catherine? It's okay. I think I should tell you face to face. Huh? Come see me tomorrow, okay? Good night. Change jobs. I don't have any cash. I can't marry her like this. Fuck. Go to the arcade machine to play a video game. You can play up to three games a night. The rules are the same as the nightmare stages, however, there is no time limit, but you do have a limited number of moves. If you use up all your moves, you will get a game over, so take your time when solving the puzzle. If you can't beat the nightmare stage, you might be able to find new skills here. I hear this game is surprisingly deep, too. Let's do this! jukebox to change the background music in the bar. Acquiring trophies will earn you more songs. Try doing lots of challenging things to earn them. Some stages are supposed to be impossible, but they're a cinch if you've got technique. I think I'm pretty good at coming up with techniques. Have you played that Rapunzel? Some stage. I think I'm pretty good. Listen, Archie, you've got to become a better man. I don't know how you're ranking it, but I'm not desperate to climb the social ladder. Men are only acknowledged by their upward mobility. Don't be a tumbleweed. Be like Ivy, always climbing. Listen, Archie. I don't know how... Men are only... Still, you're cheating? That's big news. Don't you care about Catherine? Uh, of course, but I feel like I wasn't even involved with it. Well, you were. I hate to be so confrontational, but gee. Men who cheat are cursed. If that rumor is real, what are you gonna do? Nothing, because it's not real. I think Catherine started dating you because she just couldn't leave you alone. You're stupid in all the right ways. It tickles her maternal instincts. A dominant, independent personality like hers is usually attracted to minds like yours. Is that the way it is? Men who cheat are cursed. Nothing. Then let me introduce you. This is Todd, and this is Archie. Are you on your way home from the office? Or not? You're not wearing a suit. Suit? Oh, I don't have that kind of job. That's a shame. You're not one of our customers, then. What do you mean? We make business suits. Haven't you ever heard of Bantam suits? Have you heard the jingle? You'll be the cock of the walk in a bantam. Oh, you're from Catherine's company. Hey, I think I've heard your voice before. Huh? Have we met? Think of it. But I, I don't remember anything. Todd's a hard guy to forget. His hair looks like a rooster, doesn't it? That's enough cockadoodlery out of you. Huh. Oh, uh. Wow, you're sharp. I like my women like I like my blankets. Replaced by a maid every morning. What on earth are you talking about? 
Time will slowly pass each time you sit and talk to people. Have fun with the other bar patrons. Over time, the people and the conversation topics will change. You can go home at any time from the door in the front. I like my women like I like... What else? This is breaking news in our ongoing coverage of the rash of mysterious weakening deaths. The following people were proclaimed dead today. Those mysterious weakening deaths. I can't believe that Paul's dead. That is all the information we have up to this point. We'll revisit our top story after the local weather, in the event that there are any updates to the situation. Yeah, I wonder if the woman's wrath rumor I heard about from Erica is real. She said that I was going to die somewhere along the line. Apparently, I have a wanting look to my eyes. Would I be cursed for unfaithfulness for this, too? Whatever. Still, she really rags on you, huh? Woman's dearest delight is to wound man's self-conceit. Uh, to wrangle the words of a certain someone. But tell me. Do I look vain or otherwise untoward? I don't know, but in Erica's case, it's a bit different. Anyway, let's both avoid ending up cursed and dead. Uh, I think I'll go home for today. My head hurts. Quite a few customers come in to see Erica. It's great for me. I'm gonna head home. Excuse me. Quite a few customers. Men who cheat are cursed. Nothing. Be Married while he was pretty young. He lost a lot of money in some scam. His wife left him. He pretends not to mind, but I think it still gets to him sometimes. Even when his wife calls him, he. Huh? What do you mean? Um, well, never mind. We'll, we'll talk about it later. Oh, is that the time? I should be heading home soon. Oh, is that the time? Wow, is it that late already? Uh, it's late. Anyway, I can't hurt her anymore. Yo, Vincent, we're leaving now. You not going home yet? Uh, well, I think I'll stay and drink a little more. Ah. <sighs> long are you going to be drinking there? <laughs> Hurry up and come. Did I, did I just hear something? <laughs> Yay, you're here. That voice. Why are you here? So if I come here at this time of night, I can see you. Are you going home? I have something to do. Uh, oh. Well, I'm glad I got to see you tonight. Be careful on your way home. Just, my mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Well, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you.
Mike's area is the torture chamber, where traitors are put to rest. The main course of the deadly climb begins here. Trap blocks activate when you step on them. Don't stop on top of them. Oh, damn it. Again? How well, long is this gonna go on? It's been every night now. Got it. 